Hello guys and welcome to this uh, final episode of the um, Avatar Conquest campaign uh, for the clan competition also as well. This is um, going to be the first season that I uh, brought you guys here for the Shogun Total War game. I hope you guys have been enjoying the series um, f for the future. I will be doing updates uh, to show you guys how the Matsuda have been doing. And... Um, I've been getting some really good feedback uh, from everybody. I've picked up about 300 subscribers uh, in the past three weeks, uh, which is considering that I was sitting at 100, uh, quite a big achievement for me. So before anything, I would like to thank everybody who has been subscribing, commenting, and liking my videos. Uh, it means a lot. Um, you guys are helping the channel grow, and I really like to see uh, the feedback, and I'm really glad to know that many of you enjoy it. Um, but putting the cheese plate aside, let's take a look at actually what's happening in this last update. It is currently 12 something AM over here, and I'm on the west coast, so it's quite late for you guys who live on the east coast and in uh, uh, central time. Uh, the final updates, uh, I'm, I'm thinking this not much is going to change since there is four hours left for the season. Uh, I'm going to check in the morning and hopefully nothing changes. You can see that the Matsuda is now uh, in the second place holding 19 territories, second to the um, Borsuka clan, who have 37 territories. And uh, kudos to them for being able to hold so many territories on the map with a lot of points. Um, you can see here that uh, the lands that we do have, we do have um, pretty much a one victory, uh, uh, well, at least in the west, uh, one victory over our opponents. We do have some high pointage in some territories here. Um, so yeah, this is going to be the last video for this season. I'm going to start season two uh, as soon as season two starts, and uh, hopefully um, we'll see what happens if we'll move in the league tier, and we'll be covering more clans and more groups. And yeah, I just thought I'd let you guys know that big shout out to all the new players who have joined the Matsuda clan uh, from Kage or Outlawed. Uh, I would like to thank you guys very much. And let's just take a look here at the clan page and show you guys some of the MVPs uh, for this season. Um, if I was to claim an MVP, it would be uh, It's Dusty. It's Dusty is sitting at a 24 and 1 um, uh, ratio. This is probably one of the best ratios. This is the best ratio in our clan. Um, I know my ratio is better than 18 and 5 because I've played more battles that I've recorded on here than 18 battles. <laughs> I'm up to 30 now, so I'm probably something like 31 and 6 in reality, but um, my thing has been sort of messed up. But uh, yeah, the MVPs are definitely, it's Dusty at 24 and 1, Clappy at 28 and 9, uh, OzGamer also doing really well at 22 and 11, and then you have um, Chosen did a lot of battles here. And um, the biggest loser was Red Gremlin, uh, who'd, uh, who we've been trying to learn the game. Uh, still kudos to you for uh, trying so hard. 9 and 21. Uh, still, uh, I mean, you got to keep doing what you're trying to do, man. And uh, yeah, I just thought I'd shout out for you. I uh, appreciate what we've been trying to do. So yeah, that is pretty much all I have for this little short update. Hopefully when I wake up tomorrow, um, there isn't any big change. Uh, also, a big respect to um, uh, Atnes, who has been uh, the driving force for the Sonajoy clan. Four members, they have been able to compete with a 21-member uh, clan, and uh, definitely kudos to them. I will be contacting them um, after the season ends, and uh, congratulating them on their efforts. So yeah, that was the last update. I hope you guys have been enjoying the season, and um, jump on for the next season, and I will see you next time.